So after being named the 2018 Peach Bowl Defensive MVP and leading his undefeated UCF Knights to victory over Auburn, this April, Shaquem was drafted 141st overall by the Seattle Seahawks, where he is going to suit up with his twin brother, Shaquille, who plays cornerback for the team. Incredible. Ladies and gentlemen, joining us from Seattle via a remote connection, please welcome Shaquem Griffin. Shaquem, I hope you can hear us because there is a room full of more than 800 people cheering you on and we're just a small piece of this country that is so excited for you. How you doing? Huh? Can't complain. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's still nice up here. I feel good. I feel at home. So there's no reason for me to complain. I'm feeling good. <laughs> well, I personally have been following you on the Today Show because we've gotten to do a couple spots with you. And I haven't gotten a chance to meet you yet, but it is so nice to talk to you. And, um, you know, you have spent your entire life proving doubters wrong. So how did it feel when you finally heard your name called for the NFL draft? I mean, it was it was crazy. I mean, that whole that whole time it was just been a, it was like full of ups and downs for me, not knowing where I was gonna go, when I was gonna go, or what team's gonna give me an opportunity to play. And I'm just so thankful that you know Seattle was a team who gave me an opportunity. And when I got that phone call, man, it's like I couldn't feel my heartbeat anymore. And it was just amazing. And have my family around me, being able to enjoy that experience, it, it couldn't. It was no better feeling. And to this day, it's still hard to explain. It, it feels like so real right now. You know, your story, your achievements, they've made you this transformational role model for kids with disabilities across the United States and really across the world. So some of them are actually in the audience with us tonight. So I want you to tell us about some of the connections you've made and how sports has really been so important in, in bringing you all together. I mean, sports has been one of the best connections I ever had because you know, throughout all the, the, the times and all the doubt that I had, you know, me being able to overcome and push myself to, to no limitations has just been a whirlwind because I was able to be, in, impact people. I was able to set example for people. I was able to set a role for everybody to be able to, to walk on and be able to show what they can do, no matter how many hands or how many legs or whatever you have. You can be able to do whatever you put your mind to, and I'm glad that football was that platform for me to do so. And you know, even though I'm past the college stuff, it's time for a new journey in my life, and I'm I'm ready ready to attack it. So we told you, you know, there's there's a whole group of people in this room, more than 800 people in our audience tonight. What do you hope that they take away from this event, and you know, from from your example as well? I mean, the best thing I can tell them is keep doing what you're doing. Be caught in the, be caught in the act of being yourself. You know, never let nobody tell you or dictate who you're going to be or what you're going to be in life, you know, because at the end of the day, when you wake up in the morning and you brush your teeth and wash your face, the only person that's going to be able to dictate who's going who's to become a good person is yourself. And you got to remember that you can't allow nobody to, to put negativity or anything that's going to dictate what kind of person you're going to be out of life because I never let anybody do it. And I know the kids, I know everybody else who, who's fighting to be great, they're not going to let nobody tell them what they can't do. Well, we love that. And, you know, the added bonus to your story is that your twin brother, Shaquille, you guys have always played side by side, youth sports, high school, college, and now the Seahawks. I mean, come on. So how excited are you to take the field with him this fall? And, and how important is family to you? I mean, I'm so excited to be, uh, be a part of this family. I'm, a, I'm excited to be a part of my brother. I'm excited to be back with him again. And family is so important. And I think me being have an opportunity to be in Seattle and be around with my brothers and you know create new brothers here. You know this this program is totally different from a lot of other programs. You know you get that family vibe where you don't have to you know walk in the morning and feel uncomfortable. I mean, like I said, I feel at home here, and I'm just glad that you know you know Seattle was able to, to bring me in as a part of their family and you know it's it's no better feeling than, than being being here. Well, we are so excited for you. We can't wait to watch you this fall. And I mean, you have so many people rooting you on. So good luck. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you.
How cool is he? And if you guys haven't seen the spots that we've done with him on the Today Show, you have to check them out because, I mean, the way he and Shaquille just kind of rag on each other and the confidence is just so high, it's so inspiring. And have you ever seen a Skype connection work that well before? So <laughs> that was awesome.